doing. They're really going to be about how mediocrity in sports and entertainment, these, these heads on sticks are like the voices. Cracks me up. Because uh, Kendrick uh, Perkins and um, J.J. Rick got into it because Kendrick called him Elvis with the sideburns. And it was the whole thing about Nikola Djokovic about is he stat patting. And Joker said he heard it. Yeah, I think Joker's stat pads. But you see, no one calls him out on it because they don't. he's not held to the same standards that Giannis and Tupapupa was. Skin plays a part. He's just not held to the same standards. Now, in my world, he should be going to the finals with all the individual stuff. He just got his 100th career triple-double. And triple doubles go like no biggie now. But he's only six behind LeBron James for a career, which is crazy. He's been eating them up. He's been gobbling them up. But he's not, you know, I'm not even riding with LeBron like that. But Djokovic ain't half the player LeBron is. But still, um, J.J. Reddy came to his defense. Kendrick had an issue with it. It was interesting. But this got me thinking about, like, I remember watching American Idol when Paul Abdul and Jennifer Lopez were judges. And I want to know, when did mediocrity get to critique what the eyeball test should be able to see and say? This is the things that get pushed on the agenda. They take third tier, fourth tier people and have them as like judge and jury about standards when you're watching sports or it happened in the NFL, they used to do that all the time in the NFL. Remember, I remember Merle Hodges and Mark Malone. And then you got Sean Salisbury and um, you had um, Tim Hasselbeck. They got these busters who, if you like I, I've done this before, if you go to ESPN, I don't know if you go to YouTube, these clips, and you go see their career highlights, it ain't but a minute and a half long. And over half of it was before they even entered the league because how they got hooked up, I still don't know. You know, Kendrick, Kendrick Perkins is madly overrated. If Mean Muggin was a stat, he'd be top five GOAT. And J.J. Reddick, he, wrote, he was a pine rider, 13, 14, 15 point average, which was nice, but not worth nobody being somebody that you have to listen to critiques. It's hilarious. Just like... Paul Abdul judging on American Idol or watching um, Katy Perry for that matter while you're jiving. Because between Paul Abdul, Katy Perry, Britney Spears was judging on one of them shows and and, and uh, Jennifer Lopez. I'm like, are you... These standards of mediocrity to critique things in sports and entertainment is embarrassing, to say the least. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome, thoughts, or comments, and I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another shit if you want to. And yeah, it's a bad joke. I'm out.